huge happy computers can you get in 24 hours if you never leave the game? That's the question on my mind today. Pet Simulator 99 updated just six hours ago, and in that time, we have almost 25,000 huge happy computers that have been hatched. So today's challenge is simple. Get as many huge happy computers as you can before you can't get any more. With that, let's start the clock. Now, I'm not gonna lie. I don't actually know which egg is the best one to hatch, or if they're even better to hatch like the lower eggs instead of the higher eggs. So we're gonna do a little bit of science experimenting whilst also trying to grind to get the huge happy computer. Yes, science! We're gonna hatch a little bit of the lower eggs, and then we're gonna hatch a little bit of the higher eggs. The thing about it, though, both of those require coins. And we've got 1.5 billion, but if we're gonna be doing this for 24 hours, first we're gonna need to actually get some coins. So because I don't wanna have to worry about this ever again, I'm gonna go back here. I'm gonna equip the best pets that I have. Make sure I have enchants that allows me to get the most coins. Then we'll put on the coins potions, as well as the breakable potions. I'll put down max amounts of fortune flags, which is two and a half hours worth. And we will sit here and grind coins until it runs out. That's two and a half hours worth of grinding. We're gonna set up shop right here and we wait. All right, so we're working on that there. The timer is going there, but that's not all that we're going to be doing. We need to see what's gonna happen if I have a whole bunch of luck boosts on. Do they even matter? I've had a lot of people ask me that on Twitter. Do the huge hunter game passes work? What about the huge potions? What about the luck potions? Well, we're gonna find all that out. And to do that, we need a control. So I'm actually gonna hop on this computer right here on my alt account and also grind to get coins just like this guy here. There's just one problem. Uh, I haven't actually played on my alt account in like a month and a half. So it's just a little behind. Definitely not in tech world. Anyway, let's get grinding. And for the next 45 minutes, I painstakingly grinded on my alt account and rebirth not once, but twice to finally get to the tech world. Then upon getting to the tech world, I got to the end and started grinding coins there. All right, we got both things actually set up grinding now. All I can do is wait for the next couple of hours. It's Saturday night. I'm going out to have some fun. Now, you're probably asking, what did I do for fun? Well, my family and I went salsa dancing. They say to always try new things. And the new skill we are learning this year is ballroom dancing because the Riz. Here's my son and daughter practicing together. And well, I kind of forgot to have someone record me practicing, but this is basically what it looked like. La la, la 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 la. La, 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 la. But like, I, I wasn't dancing alone, I promise. It's, I wasn't that weird. My wife was there dancing with me, I promise. Anyway, let's fast forward a few hours because while we were dancing at home, my PC had been grinding and had reached the max amount of coins. All right, I'm back from a night out and I have maxed out the amount of coins that I can get, 200 billion tech bars. So now we're gonna start grinding for the huge happy computer, which, uh, oh my God, dude, that is happening real fast. <laughs> we almost got everything in place. The only thing that we're going to need to do is to make sure we put on our huge potions as well as some lucky egg potions as well as this cocktail. And we'll use this enchant loadout, which gives me a bunch of huge hunter enchants as well as the lucky eggs. I now have everything that I need and we're going to go over here and start hatching for the night. And so now it's pretty late. So uh, I'm gonna let that go actually through the night. And then over on this screen, this one is also going through the night. Now the difference between the two is that this one over here has a whole bunch of enchants and huge hunters and lucky potions. Whereas this one is our control and it has absolutely nothing on it. So we'll compare the two in the morning. We'll see how it goes. It looks like there's about 17 hours and 30 minutes. So uh, we've got still the best better part of the day. Anyway, I'm going to bed. Good night, gamers. Gosh. <laughs> Good morning, gamers. It is 8 a.m. It's been going on through the night. Let me show you. As you can see, it's still going. We got this one up here. We got this one up here. This one's the main account with all the boosts and stuff. And this one up here is the control account with none of the boosts. I was actually worried that it was going to lag out during the night and shut down the servers. And so I'd walk in with both of these being disconnected. But they're still going. There's 10 hours left. We've been hatching for seven hours straight. And and I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a quick look just to see where we're at in the process. All right, let's see how many my control account actually hatched last night. He got two last night and I ended up with also two. <laughs> 
I guess this makes sense. It's expected. It means the huge hunter game pass and the huge potion that I spent millions on to try to get the active huge. Oh uh, yeah, they do nothing. I guess that theory is debunked. We hatched eight hours. We only got two each for a total of four. It looks like 176,000 has been claimed. Now let's move on to part two. And in part two of this, instead of using the first egg to hatch, which is what I saw basically everybody doing last night, we're gonna go use the last egg. We still got 199 billion. I basically spent one bar for eight hours last night. <laughs> so I expect this to go a lot quicker. The question is, will I run out of bars? On top of being able to get the happy computer by using the last egg, we also are gonna be able to do the active huges, which are currently those three up there. So the next time we check in, we'll also check to see if we got any of the active huges. With that, let's get grinding. All right, both are set up to go. There's nine hours and 47 minutes left. Let's go ahead and get our Sunday started. And what does everybody's morning usually start with? Uh <laughs> Wait, no, 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 no. I mean, breakfast. And you already know your boy gonna be cooking. I made the animals breakfast. And yes, before you say anything, I do have too many animals. Look at their little faces. Then after I ate, I headed out to do one of my favorite activities. That's right, baby. We're hitting the ski slopes. These are my skis that I sat on because I, I actually was going to just watch my daughter ice skate. Don't get me wrong. I like doing it. She's really good at it. But like, it's kind of boring for me. <laughs> <laughs> then I went to the store to find some much needed groceries before rushing home because 12 o'clock was about to hit and something crazy was about to happen. All right, we just returned from the ice skating. We now have two minutes until this plushie drops. Obviously, everything is still going, which is great news. We'll check all that in a little bit, but we're gonna see if we can get some titanic plushies here. And I'm actually gonna move over here. So this is still going on. And while it's going on in the background, we are on our computer. We're gonna try to get some plushies. Recently, I've had no problem getting the plushies as they come out, but I haven't been using my computer. I've been using my phone. And I think for whatever reason, I have a lot more luck doing this than I do with doing this. So we're going to buy it on my phone. And then after I buy it on my phone, I'm going to buy it on the computer. We're going to see how many we can get. I really want the bread Shiba. I don't really care about the Kawaii cat as much, but the bread Shiba looks freaking amazing. Let's just do a refresh just to make sure there's three seconds, two seconds, one second. Add to cart. Okay. 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 Shop now. Add to cart. Check out. And then while I'm checking out, I'm going to go here. We're going to shop now. We're going to add this to the cart and we're going to add this to the cart and we're going to pay. We're going to check out here. It says I'm waiting in line. It's less than a minute. Boom. I got it. Boom, I got it again. I got three each. Maybe I'll do a giveaway when I get them. It looks like they're still available though. I will say this, the more they put out all of these plushies, the less people are gonna like rush to try to get them. One, mainly because there's so much that the hype behind them isn't really as crazy as it used to be. But then two, like a lot of people are buying these plushies and then they just don't have the funds and don't have it in them to buy more. Have Pet Simulator not literally been my job? I, I don't think I could justify buying these either. It doesn't make any sense. It is going to be interesting to see how these guys do because they don't come with the little plush codes. I have a sneaking suspicion that these guys are not going to sell out near as quickly as the bigger ones because people want the codes. They want the in-game pet. They don't really care too much about the out of the game pet. Either way, we drop some money on some plushies. We'll get them in a few days. There's six hours left and we'll check back in in a few to see kind of where we are on things. Let's go back to the grind. By the way, five minutes in, the Titanic Bread Shiba actually sold out. The Titanic Kawaii Cat's still available, basically meaning that everybody had the same thought that I did. After buying the plushies for the next few hours, I let the accounts AFK hatch. I did find myself running out of coins, so I tried to do the trick where you put your pets in the last area with magnet flags. That way you can gain coins while hatching and never run out of funds. Then I went and enjoyed the rest of my Sunday. Little did I know that was one of the worst mistakes I could have made. You see, while I was away, everyone on Twitter was complaining. It seems as though with this new update, auto 
farming coins while hatching causes your game to lag so much that it has to work really hard to catch up. And when this happens, it full on skips the huge hatch animation and you don't get the happy computer even though you were supposed to. When I saw this news hours later, I rushed down to my PC. And yeah, as you can see, it's completely just stopped. I thought I was doing like something cool and trying to like save me from running out of things, which my other alt account did actually run out because I had to spend extra time getting to the back spot than uh, this one who was just kind of just going along. But I actually put both of them so that I would never have to worry about running out. And in doing so, it's it's like completely, completely laggy. Like if I were to go through here, the whole game is just, I can't even jump. I'm going to have to reset. I'm going to have to leave. I said I wasn't going to leave for 24 hours and now this glitch is making me have to leave for like two minutes. Anyway, there's three hours and 45 minutes left. We'll keep trucking along and then we'll see how many we have a little bit closer towards the end. And almost instantly after fixing this issue, I started hatching things left and right. I got not one, not two, but four huge pets within the next hour. Time was running down, but I still had enough coins to finish out this challenge. With the last few hours remaining, my PC was hard at work hatching while I went to a concert and enjoyed one of my favorite bands of all time. <laughs> got home just in time for the clock to run to zero. This challenge was over. And we have come to the end. 24 hours. A lot of ups and downs. And there's only a few things left to find out. Almost 400,000 computers have been found. And how many of those computers do I own? Well, if we pull it up, we type in computer and we see the list. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six regular, one golden, and one rainbow for a total of eight happy computers on my own. We found out a few things. One yeah, these uh, huge hunters and luck boosts basically do nothing for this. Even the huge potions and luck potions do absolutely nothing. And honestly, I'm fine with that. This is supposed to be a free to play event. And it's just not fair if the free to play players can't get as many as the pay to win. I also found out that it seems as though there may be a slightly higher chance in the end egg as there is in the beginning. Because I only got two in the beginning. And then I got the rest of the seven at the end despite despite having the issues with the auto farming and me spending about an hour less with the egg overall. So if I ended up with eight happy computers, how much did the alt account do? Let's go find out. As we can see, my control account also did pretty well, including getting a golden. And if we count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven happy computers on an account that had zero boost, zero game passes, and zero luck or huge enchants on. So with my eight, in his seven, I have a total of 15 computers, two of which are golden, one of which is a rainbow. But like my main team consists of all my titanics and shinies and rainbows. And well, I've got a bunch extra, so I'm not really going to be using any of these, which means I did all that 24 hours just so that I can give some huge happy computers away. If you want one, hit that subscribe button. Comment your username down below. Let me know if this video was helpful and then go check out this next video for me. I'll pick some winners and I'll mail them to you in your mailbox. Thanks for watching, gamers. Happy hatching. You better hurry.